Hi, welcome to my short tutorial on how to make a pet follow you around. So for this one, we're going to bring out an asset that we want to follow the avatar. So I'm just going to type in bot and I'm going to bring out this green diamond bot. You can press the marketplace button to add it to your library if you don't have it. So go ahead and bring one of these out and we'll select it and give it a behavior. In this case, we'll give it a predator behavior. Um, and just a little bit about the behavior, we'll go ahead and edit the logic. Uh, we'll get rid of the health component. And what we have here is uh, the tags that it's going to attack is either prey or avatar. So we're going to make this item or this asset attack the avatar, but we're going to make it do zero damage. So just go ahead and make attack damage down uh, to zero. Um, and then a chasing area, we want to cover the whole map so it follows the avatar everywhere or wherever you want it to follow in your map so here it is um, now the max hunger is how many times it will hit before it stops hitting because it's full so we're just going to go ahead and make that a thousand so it's a big number and we also want the um, predator to get hungry faster as well so it's constantly attacking uh, our target uh, we'll bring the attack range to so it's closer to the avatar now if we go ahead and click tab to test play, you can see that we already have something that's following us, uh, that's trying to attack us. Uh, if you want it to hang closer, all you need to do is make the attack range smaller. Now you'll notice when you press tab, uh, it has an attacking symbol underneath. Uh, which is not very appealing, especially if you're trying to get immersion. You can remove that. All you need to do is add a indicator component. Go ahead and turn off everything. So everything to false and change the visibility distance to zero. Now when we tab and test play, you can see there is no more attack symbol. And now the uh, pet is following us around. As expected. Now you can do a couple of other tricks to make it a bit more interesting. We can bring out a robot. Uh, this robot here can be a enemy and that enemy will have a tag which is hostile. So we'll go ahead and select our pet and we'll give it a speaker component. Uh, we'll get rid of the name up the top so it has no name and we can say warning uh, hostile detected and we can detect entity and we can detect for hostile here so now the pet when it's following us around if it detects an enemy it will give us a warning you can make it say whatever you want uh, but it just gives extra utility for the pet that's following you around and some other ideas You don't have to have a predator. Uh, you can have a healer follow you around, but you need to be damaged Otherwise if you're full health it stops following you around, which is not cool uh, But yeah, this is the short tutorial. I hope you learned something if you discover any tricks send me a message I'm keen to learn too. Uh, have a great day all the best